Legend of Total War here with part 118 of my Rome 2 Legendary Let's Play campaign as Rome. On the last episode, I um, declared war on the fucking Armenians, taking Trapezos and Arsimasata. And on this video, I intend to take Armavir and Tushpa, which should leave me with 138 total regions and will satisfy this criteria here is taking all of Armenia and then I'll only need two more I'll see if I can take them this turn um, also to note that I might lose Susia might lose Merv so maybe I should over overcompensate and actually try to take a few more I might be able to take Mero this turn maybe Anyway, I'll think about that in a minute. Let's start with Armenia. I uh, might also be losing Gabala because of uh, because of that, but whatever. Oh, there'll also be a rebellion here. Pretty sure. Because I'm going to get out of here, and we're going to go after Armavir. I estimate there'll be one full stack in here. Let them power Hang on. 13 plus 12. Well, that's close enough to a full stack. Now... Because it's a walled settlement and I have no artillery, it would be easier for me to do a field battle, I think. So I'm going to aim for this fucker right here. And draw them out. This in Medieval 2 is what I would call a draw out. You don't need to do it so much in this, but that's yeah, good. What am I up against? Alright, so we have garbage, lots of garbage, more garbage, 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 and some more garbage. No problem. These guys are called, well their army is called Fire and Steel. More like fucking garbage. In fact, after this battle I'm going to change my name from Legio 8 Thracian Thrashers to Garbage Men, because it's their job to take out the fucking trash. And that's really the only way I can describe these Armenians out here. They've certainly got a better unit roster than what they're currently using, but that's probably largely due to um, what they've got is largely due to um, previous patches recruitment. Um, had I started on patch 9, um, I'm sure they would have a much more professional army by now. As I see it, an uh, I, maybe I should get up on the hill. Can't see them. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Whatever. Now, I need to try and make sure I kill as many of them as possible, or else I've got a big battle inside of the city next. Well, essentially, I really could have fought the city and been fine with it, but I reckon I'll get a much better result on a field battle. There they are. It's probably in my best interest to let the actual reinforcements arrive. Provided they don't come hit me in the ass. At the moment, I can't see them. I really should have checked to see where they'd be coming from. I always have my guys run. General. There they are. They've got a lot of horse skirmishes, which I think are some of the worst units in the game. And especially for the AI. I just don't find them very useful. They've got like, what, nine shots? And once that's used up, they're, they're useless in melee. In melee. They're only really good, I suppose, against some very, very light basic troops. Okay, I'm going to make my attack while they're reforming. And we're going to go into lock formation group. 
and attack so that I don't have to select them each individually. Keep my general over here. It's all friggin' horse skirmishes, so... I should actually send my guys in. That's fine. Equities are pretty good at wiping these guys out. In fact, even mob are pretty good at wiping these guys out. To some extent. Okay, they'll select their targets any second from now. They, yep, there they go. This guy over here, I better be careful. He's probably in the most danger. I've been in this kind of situation before. These, All of these missile units are going to strike. I have to roll up the carpet, basically. Bring my army over to a system before they die. Should have thought about that. Been in this situation before. Come on, come on. Move it, equities. So far, so good. I've barely lost anything. Like I said, I am really up against garbage. But fucking well get a move on it. Don't bother chasing them that way. Okay, General, you do some bit of cleanup duty. I've lost about three cavalry so far. That Royal Cataphract. Now that's a decent unit. As you can see, I'm, that's the unit that's taken the most damage. And the other one's taken the most damage is this one, where you'd expect it, where the bulk, bulk of their uh, army is. Come on, over here this way. Equities, come on. You guys need to go around. Let the infantry deal with the cataphracts. So I also need to stay in as good uh, condition as possible because we've got another battle for these guys afterwards at the other fucking settlement. I can't remember what it's called. My cavalry are raping. Alright, time to roll up the carpet, as I say. Eastern spearmen, can't let them sit there attacking me. Gotta break them. Pretty easy. Yep. Now fucking push them out of here. General, General you're going to be needed over here as well. Here we go. Mass route. That battle, I don't think it could have gone any better. Could have gone any worse for the Armenians. Probably still going to have to have a battle at the city, which I might just be able to auto resolve. But of course, just kill as many of them here as possible. This kind of result could not have been done without the effectiveness of my cavalry in this battle. guys 450 kills 202 275 500 342 see what I'm talking about these equities did a fantastic job kills there. Tearing it up. Tore them a new one. And then some. How'd the infantry go? 400 kills there. 
the rest didn't do so much. General. This here I can tell is garrison. Obviously good, good to get rid of them. I might be able to just waltz right into the city. Maybe. Whatever the case, I'm definitely going to be able to keep this army marching. Oh, I think that's it. There's, don't see anything else that needs to be done. Look at those fucking Armenian bodies everywhere. Shit, what a massacre. The Turkish couldn't even do a better job than that. Oh, they're not all annihilated. The garrison is. A near 40 to 1 kill ratio, that. Let's see. Well, that's uh, Keepers of the Peace is useful. Now then. I think this will be auto-resolve worthy, for sure. Um, just thinking. Alright, yeah, do it. Uh, these guys, good. I was hoping that they would be able to be fought. Now that's strange. Well, whatever. Just, yeah, auto resolve it, because, I mean, 5% casualties is not going to mean anything. This is near the end of the road for them anyway. So I lost, I lost 116 men on that one. Jeez, ridiculous. But they're all dead. Now all we have to deal with is this. Now both this army and this one should be able to get to Tushpa. It's shorter distance from here to there, but I might instead be able to get this guy back to Mitsketa in order to deal with this army and whatever rebellion's going to show up here. And these guys here, at Siracena, I'm going to move them down here. So they can take out Samandar. What happened to the um, army that was around here? Oh, I wonder if a cavalry unit can get from there to there. I'll I'll risk that. I, I reckon that'd be that'd be good because I need another re regents. Uh, how many more? Three, I think. Two more non-Armenian regents. Okay, so let's hire another general. Someone's got a lot of movement points is needed for this. That guy's got 26 plus public order. Um, I'd like to save him for later. This guy's got 34 plus public order. This guy's got 16, 26. Alright, we're going to go try with him. Reinstate. These, yes. As this. Ready for Do they make it? Do they make it? Do they? Fuck! They don't make it. No. Oh, that's a shame. Alright, let's go have a look at anyway, what's there. There's nothing there. Damn it. Fucking just doesn't make it. Oh well. That was a mistake. No big deal. Alright. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna send Uh let's see, what's this? They need to be dealt with. Can't just ignore them. 
Ready for battle. I'm going to send these guys. First thing I need is a general that can make it there first. So, we're going to need someone with movement speed. This guy's got 34. We're going to go with you. Fuck! Doesn't make it. Oh well, I'm going to use you then to take these guys down. Destroy them. I guess they're going to be stuck here. Oh shit. No, I don't want to risk your life taking out... Hmm. This is interesting. I might be able to do one of those, the battles like I did last time, to use General's Bodyguard to take out these Eastern Spearmen might actually be possible. They have to, of course, take out the Slingers first. This is going to be difficult, but I think I can do it. I mean, I got some backup here, too. Now, we're going to go for a wet day, I think. Not going to happen. That's fine. The reason I wanted a wet day is because it'll... Hang on. Oh, because he's got second wind, so he can recover his stamina really quickly. And if it's raining, they won't be able to. So what's this? Inspire. That's useful. Reinforcements are useless. Don't worry about them. So what I gotta do firstly, take out the slingers. Absolutely vital I take out the slingers. Once the slingers are dead, exhaust the friggin' Eastern Spearmen. And having the high ground should help. So what exactly does Inspire do? Improve what? Melee attack, melee defense, accuracy, reload skill. Wait till the last second. That should be all that's required out of that. Our general is under attack. He's okay. Once they've lost the slingers, they will come after me, I'm sure. Of that. No, I guess not. Fair enough. If they want to stay in that position, that's fine. Flank. Good, hit them right now. Good, and then get out of there if you would. We get fucking destroyed by crap spearmen. How many did we kill? Oh, hardly any. That's okay. Maybe it is time to bring these guys up. They're ages away, though. They want to run after me, that's fine. Essentially, I should really be trying to kill the enemy general. Kill him first, the, the rest will rat a lot easier. Never charge uphill. Fire. How are we going? So far, so good. Make sure you kill that general. So far, I haven't lost a single man in this particular fight. They're doing well. But they're probably losing hit points, which will make them weaker against this slot here.
the fuck, I killed the enemy general, right? Alright. Next time I charge into them, I've got to charge their rear. That's why I'm bringing these guys in. They might actually be useful. Facing that direction for some reason. Probably because that's where my infantry are coming from. Here we go. Charging into their back is the best thing I can do. Hang on, they're re-maneuvering, repositioning, and probably a bit too late for them. Get out of there. Cool. No de oh, look at this idiot. Ah, oh, lucky fuck. So where are my reinforcements? They're still ages away. There's really no point waiting around for them. Alright, we'll try a head-on charge, see how that does. I mean, they are on the Eastern Spearmen. I have the high ground. That's enough. Don't fight them like that. Just charge. Just hit and run. That seemed to be okay. The thing is, I think the general's in the front, so if he dies, it could lower the morale of the, uh, the rest of the guys. Although their base morale isn't too bad. Again. Bit of a charge, not great. Just get them out of there. I'm surprised I'm not losing losing cavalry. Even against the Eastern Spearmen. One or two more charges and they'll be done. That's it. Don't stay still, because it makes it easier for me to kill you. Okay, that's one more charge or to do it. Nope, no need. They're dead. Uh, I don't think I need to chase them down, but I will anyway. Well, that went better than I expected. Finally, some recognition. And that'll stop them from fucking me around. They could have hired mercenaries and taken another region, so I've put an end to that. Now, this guy is no longer required. Now, this. Need to get rid of them. I might just auto-resolve it, because I should have pretty good odds. It is an honor to serve Rome. Uh, we'll see. Yeah, I think I'm going to have pretty good odds if they're running away from me. And even if I don't, as long as it's victory, because I just don't need this navy anymore. Fuck, those are good odds. Much better than I thought I'd get. Probably due to the amount of, you know, quality javelin men, as opposed to my javelin men are better. And they're sunk. And then this navy will go sit on faces. So that if a rebellion does happen and it shows up at faces, these guys can at least try to protect it. A rebellion's not going to happen this turn, though. No, it's not going to happen. So that's good. I might still lose Kabbalah, though. Well, that's, I think that's a given. Alright, these guys. Get him that. That's. Don't need that. Uh, Alright, so. At Armavir, let's destroy that. That's okay, we'll leave it. That's okay, we'll leave it. Arsamasata, that needs to be destroyed. Now, Tushpa. This guy needs to get there. Shouldn't be a problem. 
We've got five generals left to choose from. The one with the least amount of movement needs to uh, initiate the attack. I think it's this guy. I can probably auto resolve this battle. Good. He makes it very much easily. No problems there. It's okay, he's just initiating the battle. Probably we'll just auto resolve this one if the odds are favorable. Someone with good public order per turn would be would be very useful to me. That'd be this guy. Pick him up. Send him over. Disband him. And then strike. And the price is right. So I'll go with it. Oh shit, what happened to them? Fuck. Doesn't matter. This is probably the end of the Armenians. And that's it, they're dead. Uh, okay, so with Armenians dead, I now hold all the regions I need to. Just need two more. Uh, this guy can be disbanded. Give him his level up first. No, that's useless. that and you I would rather they be sitting in Armavir but we'll just wait and see what's available with um, with daisy chaining afterwards I don't need to tax this region um, there's nothing I can do to take Samandar this turn hang on fix that up what am I doing Let's see, is this region being taxed? Good. Though it could be. Okay, so I need two more regions. I see no reason why I can't take Bukhara. Kath is too far away. I could take Bukhara and then Marikanda. I don't see a problem with that. But that's not going to be victory because I'm still going to probably lose one or two regions. But I don't see any... Oh, hang on, hang on. What about in Arabia? No, 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 no. In Ethiopia? Mero. However, to do that, we have to take out these guys. I'll worry about that next time. Let's take Bukhara. So we this guy here needs battle. to be disbanded. Sit them there. Amul Bukhara is not part of this province. This province needs to not be taxed as well. Let's daisy chain. Okay, whoever's got the least amount of movement becomes a cavalry general, send him over there first to scout it. I'm not going to be able to daisy chain all over the place. This guy. Level 8, yep. Commander. Besieging the settlement. Yep, I'm not going to be able to claim victory this turn. None will I don't have enough movement. because I still need to get this guy over to Bukhara. Essentially anyone will do, but this guy here has reduced upkeep costs, so we'll send him him in there. Bl minus 5 upkeep for all land units. Is that faction-wide? Doesn't really make that very clear. Uh, we'll go with Hispania. Uh, doesn't seem to be. I reckon this can be an auto-resolve battle. Send him off. Force march to here. Victory for Rome. Let them cower before awesome. Rome. Nothing to worry about here. Damn it, if 
I didn't waste that general trying to take out um, that uh, Scythian one, I could probably get another region now. I've only got one general, which isn't enough. We hunger for battle. Okay, yeah, you're, you're done. What's this? That ah, shit. Get that. And then... Disband. Ready for Set up the watch. Don't tax it. One more region. If only those fucking guys didn't bloody betray me. I'll see if they'll accept the alliance now. Come on, you kind of like me, don't you? My master extends the most magnificent welcome to you and your honorable people. What Fuck you. you oh, come on. What about the Helvetii? All the way up here. Surely they're up for a, to suck my dick. I am sure you have many pleasant They'll accept for it. Me, but Let's just see if I can take any of their regions first. Moved. Yep. Oh, this guy has to... Oh, shit. Looks like I'm going to lose Ak Inc. Unless, unless these guys decide to go to Istros. Ready for battle. I can't get to him. Now, this one here, where am I going to send him? I'm going to take Lupferdum. And I'll show you how. We hunger for battle. Besieging the settlement. That path is blocked. None will escape. Now, I don't know if this is going to mean victory. I'm pretty sure I have to end the turn and then end, begin the turn with 140 regions, but we'll see. I might be able to auto-resolve this one. Let's see. At least I'm making maximum use out of my generals, and even though I couldn't do daisy chaining anywhere else, then I'm glad at least this is going to be possible. Make sure I'm there. Nah, can't daisy chain this. Nah. How long has this video been going for? 30 minutes. That's how long I kind of want these videos to go for. So we'll deal with this on the next turn. Alright. So I'm ending the video here. So uh, not on the next. not dealing with this on the next turn and the next video. Anyway, like and subscribe. Part 119 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. I'll see you next time.